Wie sehe ich aus? Ist die Krawatte zu gelb? Tadellos. Du bist der Schönste. Ach, ich bin der Schönste. So. 50 Sekunden. Du bist der schönste Arbeitslose in ganz Nigeria. Lars, positive thinking, okay? Reiß uns nicht runter mit deiner Depri-Scheiße. Ja, ich versuch's ja. Oh Gott. Mein Gesicht ist ja total zerkratzt. Zeig mal. Mach die Haare drüber. Wie? So, oder? Ja, ist besser. Nein! Ach. 15 Sekunden. Deine Krawatte sieht so kacke aus. Leck mich. Ich bin der Schönste. Fünf Sekunden. Hallo allerseits. Ich bin John Schönekau, euer neuer Boss. Hi John. John. Hi John. Kommen wir gleich zur Sache. Was ist das? Das sind eure Verträge. Ihr werdet Partner and I am very happy to personally invite you on board. Was? Wir werden Partner? Ja. Yeah. You will each have a stake in the company. Einfach so. Das hängt von euch ab. Wir schicken sie euch rüber. Darf ich fragen, wo Sie gerade sind? <lacht> wo bin ich? <lacht> Fantastische Frage. Where are we? Afghanistan. Ich bin in Afghanistan. Fantastische Leute. Aber ja, inefficient. Zum Beispiel, Suicide Bombers, one in every two explosive belts goes off before it's supposed to do. Why? Because tradition dictates that before the fighters go to war, they have to give each other a goddamn great brotherly hug. Boom! <laughs> Wenn die keine Hilfe brauchen, wer dann? Wir sollen sofort unterschreiben. Habt ihr einen Scanner? Sign on the dotted line, send back in time, you're in business. Okay, aber... Um... Freunde, das ist nur für Chancenergreifer. Wenn es eure Dinge nicht ist, kein Problem, wir vergessen es. Diese Konferenz ist nicht stattgefunden. Diese fantastische Angebote wurde nicht gemacht und ihr bleibt in... Wo? Lagos? Lagos. Eure Entscheidung. Nein, 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 nein. So war das ja nicht gemeint. Also ich würde sofort unterschreiben. Mir persönlich reicht ein Handshake between you and me. I can think of a goddamn lot better things to do with my money than give it to that goddamn lawyer. Sein Haus ist größer als meins. <lacht> Unglaublich. Noch Fragen? Wir freuen uns auf die Zusammenarbeit. See you at the top. See, you found the suitcase then. Hey. <clears throat> so, how are you enjoying the city? I think the city is enjoying me. Yeah, yeah there's a big appetite. You hungry? Yeah. yeah. Want something to eat? Yeah. With pleasure. Thanks. All right. Where are you from? Where am I from? The city. Which one? What difference does it make? They're all the same. It doesn't matter where you're from. All that matters is where you are, you know? In the moment, in your life. 
Understand? I don't know where I am. <sighs> Come on. You're not as lost as you think. Yeah, look at that. Passive depressive. What? Passive depressive? Yeah, vous êtes français, I can hear it in your uh, uh, depressive passive. <laughs> huh? From the big family of sad and lost little souls, you know. I have to write that down. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> An active depressive. <laughs> what do you see? <sighs> An empty bottle. Yeah, what else? <laughs> and a lot of problems. Yeah. All I can see is solutions. Here's an empty bottle. In that empty bottle, I can see a solution to the problem of my hunger. You will eat it, my young rat. Very funny. Yeah, look, what I mean is, every time I look at an empty bottle, I can see a plate full of food. Now, in this city, all the bottles are uh, recyclable, you know, returnable, so it's worth 25 cents. I mean, that's nothing to the person that threw it away, but to me, that's my daily bread, okay? See, because picking up the bottle keeps you active, but you do something, and at the end of the day, you can eat. You survive, all right? That's the important thing. Keep moving. Because moving is living. If you stop moving, you die. You understand? Where are you going? Where am I going? Forward. I go forward, kid. Where exactly? Well, if you must know, West. I'm going west. And how about you, kid? Do you know where you're going? If there is any road going somewhere else, that's mine. All right. I know one. Just keep moving. All right. Let's go. Come on, don't put the suitcase down. Lord, I gotta keep on Das Leben ist doch ein Traum. Man träumt es so, wie man es gerne hätte. Dann hat man eine Chance. Glücklich zu sein. I'm <laughs> sorry.
what you owe. Okay, I say, but I only got till three months, dude. I'm getting out of the golden nugget. Who are you gonna fuck in the golden nugget? Hmm? No one. I'm gonna go kill myself in the golden nugget. Oh, that seems to piss him off. He stomps on the gas and hits the steering wheel with his hand. Half a million women in this town are gonna pick me up crazy. I study his profile. It smells like canoe. I remind him of the last time we saw each other. <laughs> Half a million women in this town and I pick me up a crazy. Oh, turn left here, I tell him. Let me out of the golden nugget. Oh, turn left here on Freeman. Oh, uh, yeah, well, it's not the easiest thing to do this to me. He turns left on Freeman. A neon sunrise. It was Christmas last time I saw you. That time in Reno. Look, I hate Christmas. I hate Reno. I was never in Reno at Christmas. He lights a cigarette and holds it deep in the crotch of his fingers. We laid on the floor in front of the fire and drank the card. And you told me about all the women in your life. How they were all gorgeous and great in bed and all really fucked up. Well, they are all gorgeous. And you know what? They are all really fucked up. Yeah, that's right. That's what you said. Yeah. And you're the most fucked up of them all. No, that's not what you said. Oh, well, I meant to. No, you said, let's play poker till sunrise. Our clothes will be the chips. That's what you said, and we did. <laughs> we played poker till sunrise for old times' sake, and our clothes were the chips. Oh, this is going to come as a surprise to you, sweetheart, but you're not tight and red. And then just as the sun was rising, my husband came home. By then, we were both drunk. Oh, he was drunk, too. Look here, I was never in this little movie of yours, okay? I don't remember what he said. I went to the bathroom. <laughs> you left me alone with your drunken husband. Oh, no, I don't think so. I looked in the mirror and I washed my face. I would love you forever, I said, but I will never let on, never again. Where is that what you said? But that made me feel better. So that when I went to the bedroom and I laid myself out in the bed, mm -hmm. I knew that I was through with you for good. And I closed my eyes. For good? Well, that's good. You want action? You got action. You come to the right place. RonHammer.com. On our website, you can find out all the information about our forthcoming tour, the great world record breaking bike jump tour 2006. Come on in. Love. The Slammer. Get the fine whammer. You can see me jumping everything from miles. Um, how come you picked, uh, you wanted to conquer Europe? How come? Yeah. Well, it's very simple. Ronnie is number one. So he's looking around Germany, Europe, for a challenge. And we thought maybe, you know, we'd try uh, jumping over the, the Brandenburg Tor or the Reichstag or something like that. And then a lot of people started to tell us that uh, this Hornback was not just a big place, but was the biggest, and that it was number one. Well, that's our idea of a challenge, because there can only be one number one in the world. And the number one is Ron Hamilton. That's right. That's my mother. T-shirts here, no autographs, even your kisses. Ron Hamilton.